Hi everybody, this is Boaz Fad and I'm here with a weekly astrological message for the 1st of April until the 8th of April uh, 2017. So, let's begin uh, by talking about Venus. Venus is still in retrograde and it's retrograding, uh, it's regressing into Pisces. And Venus in Pisces is much more childlike, it's much more naive. On the positive side, we can become much more romantic and we want to connect with the world, we want to take part in the world and this naivety regarding relationships and love and income can be a very beautiful thing but can be something also that is harmful if we're not careful enough, if we connect with people who really should not be within our gates, if we uh, take part in any financial endeavors in this time that we have not realistically checked the, the validity of, it could be harmful. Other than that, this could be a very creative time. There's so much talent within this combination of Venus and Pisces. It's a great time to creatively work with the muses and create things in your life. Anything that connects with love, relationship, or income should be dealt with more carefully in this retrograde. Remember that there's also a lot of passivity and victim-like behavior within the sign of Pisces. And we don't want this Venusian aspects to suffer any of these effects. Other than that, on the 6th of April, Saturn is going to start its retrograde until the 24th of August 2017. Whenever a planet is retrograding, we get a different perspective regarding the subject that it rules. And of course, as you know, Saturn is the Lord of Karma, it is the judgment, it is the system, and it is our career. And both individually and within our lives in general, we could see these subjects fluctuating and changing. We could see how the system at large, or our own private system within our own lives, the, the laws and the, and the regulations that we ourselves impose on our daily life, need to be updated and need to be changed. Very much so, in the same manner, our career and the place we take amongst our peers and uh, in the gen in the in the in public in the in the public arena and we could also understand the need for reforms for laws that are no longer valid that no longer are in contact with reality as it is and need to be updated need to be changed these days between the 6th and a bit after the 8th of April are days that we should really be much more logical and keep our mind frame set on being modest and realistic and diplomatic as much as we can. Why? Because Jupiter is going to be opposing the Sun. The Sun is going to conjunct Aries and uh, Uranus, making us a lot less uh, patient with ourselves and with other people and much more um, impulsive and other than that also Mars is going to conjunct Ceres in Taurus this is a time that we can be exuberant that we can spend a lot of money uh, usually on things like food drink or material objects material goods and we need to be careful not to spend too much money on these subjects over these days and not to indulge ourselves too much this is a time to be more reserved than we usually are. So that's about it for the next week. I hope you're going to have a beautiful week and I want to thank you for listening. I'm Boaz Fader. I'm an evolutionary astrologer and of course for questions, private consultations or master classes, you're very welcome to contact me. Signing out. Thank you for listening. Goodbye.